Welcome to the Bentex 7X Step and IGES Solid Tube Import Guide. This video will show how to import a Step or IGES file, define the parts with your die and material in Bentec, and transfer the individual parts out to a single part designer in order to retrieve the bending instructions. To start an import, first select the CAD Import button from the Task Menu screen. Here, select the Tube Solid option for importing a Step or IGES file. This importer will read the raw tubes brought in, but not any previously defined cuts. Now, select your file and click the Open button to bring the file up in Bentex importer screen. Then, maximize the window and select the material and die that will be used for these parts. As you can see, Bentec will detect the diameter of material that the project was created with, along with the detected CLR for the bends. Notice in the display area that some tubes are shown in red, while the other is yellow and green. While the red tubes indicate the tubes that are currently undefined, the selected tube will display in green to indicate that it is ready to be saved as a Bentec part, and the yellow part of it indicates the start end of the tube, as it will appear in the bending instructions. With a single tube defined with its material and die, you can now click the Save Part button and add it to the parts list. For all other tubes, you'll need to click the Set Start button in the Define tab, followed by the start of each tube in order to select it, then apply the die and save the part. Straight tubes will require the same process, but without selecting a die. When you're finished saving off all the parts, select the Parts tab and click on the Select All button. Now you can transfer the entire design to Bentex assembly interface by using the transfer button from above. Once in assembly, you can view the parts in the main tab and select them from the parts tab to be sent out individually to any single part interface and retrieve the bending instructions. Of course, if you'd like to add cuts to the parts first, you'll simply click on the cutting tab in the assembly interface and generate the cut profiles as seen here. Thank you for watching this Step and IGES Solid Tube Import Guide. For more information on this procedure and others, feel free to call us at our office or email us at support at ben-tech.com.